Moreno, nice stick handling move. Left face, left circle, kill the Rashetti, scores! What a snipe there from Riker Judd, beat Letham on the glove hand side. A big power play goal late in the first period for Muskegon, 2.25 to go on the first. We're tied at one. Riker Gillen, the second goal of the season. Both coming on the power play. Around Schilling, now back the other way is Graver. In the zone, to the trailer. Booking, a wrist shot, he scores! How about that for Liam McGing? He scores against his former team. That's his first career USHL goal. With 109 to go on the first, he finally breaks the ice. Lumberjacks up two to one. How about that for getting your first career USHL goal against your former team? Side, Hallford, right face off circle, it's loose to the back door! Merrill's able to power one home in the back door! 13 seconds shy of the halfway point of the second period, Stephen Merrill got tied up on the back door, but he had just enough to sneak it past Lethem and Lumberjacks quickly regain their lead back at 3 to 2. Trying to finesse his way around Margin. Lose puck, Molino, right around the tip, march out of the back door, he scores! Lumberjacks make Chicago pay off a turnover, and Tommy Marchand's able to sneak it in from a sharp angle. To the right of Lethman, 5.36 to go in the second period. Lumberjacks up 4-2. to two. Tommy Marchand now leads the team with his 14th goal of the season. Molino, Molino, trying to skate around Kiski to his forehand, now it's his forehand and scores! With six and a half minutes to go, Paul Hansen has first career USHL goal, and the Lumberjacks get their lead back at five to four. Congratulations to Paul Hansen! Second to go, Lumberjacks are going to hang on! It wasn't easy by any stretch of the imagination, but the Lumberjacks go into the Christmas holiday break with a huge 5-4 victory over the Chicago Steel. They improved to 2-0 against the Steel and get their 18th victory of the season.